like to volunteer for the airborne. So he says, what the hell is the airborne? Nobody ever heard of it. I did them because it's what had to be done. Good luck. God bless you. They were Hitler's elite bodyguard, the ruthless protectors of their Führer. But the Nazi regime's most loyal servants were also among the most feared gladiators of World War II. The Waffen-SS, the combat units of the SS, became famous for their tenacity on the battlefield. Countless times on both the Western and Eastern fronts, Waffen-SS men were the cornerstone of the German defences, fighting to the death, even when all hope had gone. They were respected by their enemies for their fanatical courage, but feared for their barbarity. Survivors of the Waffen-SS insist that they were just soldiers doing their duty. Dietrich and his comrades in the Waffen-SS developed a combat reputation second to none. Their determination to fight on, often against impossible odds, gained the respect of their enemies and the admiration of their countrymen. They were true gladiators. But poisoned by its ideology, their tragedy was that they became the willing servants of an evil regime. Their reputation as fighting soldiers will be forever sullied by the atrocities which they committed in its name. 